Elizabeth Hasselbeck had her first day on Fox and Friends uh, today, and Gretchen Carlson has now moved to her own time slot. Mm, this ought to be good. It's going to be uh, at some point in the middle of the day. So Media Matters put together a little tribute to Gretchen. What's the role of an anchor during huge breaking news? You remember growing up, you tuned to the television, and that one moment during the year, they would have to carry a story all along. It's the same thing as being the president of the United States. Well, the silent thing that nobody's really talking about here is the reason that he was saying the middle name which so many is? times. Hussein is because the connotation is that Barack Obama is a Muslim, potentially. <laughs> so uh, obviously the voting age is 18 and the it election, you know, the election date, I understand that. I mean, uh, the fact that you could even pull out the number 12, uh, hats off to you. But, but what do you make about the fact that you got the voting age wrong? Have you ever but, felt that way where you just want to deck somebody? I am tolerant. I'm all for free speech and free rights, just not on December 25th. Well, well, I don't want to be called Smith. a dope by you. You know, when I looked up czar in the dictionary or Googled it, the word that came up was king. And I was wondering to myself why we are having so many czar czars slash kings now in America. Does anyone have the answer for me? But you know, as you think through this process, if you're a parent, a lot of kids go to activities after school. So imagine what would happen to all those small businesses. I mean, they, they might go by the wayside if kids were suddenly going to school till later hours right. in the day. I would just wanted to see how much of an insult it was to be called an ignoramus. Since I didn't know what it meant, I just Googled it. It's an ignorant lawyer. We all know Barack Obama is a lawyer. So uh, Chavez was saying that he was an ignorant lawyer. Before you know it, this country will just be called half of North America. Okay? Right. Because, oh no, wait, we can't say America either. What will we say? What will we call, what will we call this country when we can't say America anymore? <laughs> well, that's why our show is so successful, though. I, I mean, I don't know. You guys tell me what you think, because a lot of it we just sort of make up. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Oh, come on. She just got a promotion a promotion I rest my case against Fox News